हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू क्यू यूट्यूब चैनल सो इन माय लास्ट वीडियो फॉर द कुकम्बर साइप्रस सीरीज इन पार्ट टू आई हैव एक्सप्लेन हाउ वी कैन क्रिएट द फीचर फाइल देन हाउ वी कैन क्रिएट द स्टेप डेफिनेशन अगेन ईच ऑफ द सिनेरियो इन द फीचर फाइल दैट आई हैव मेंशन हियर फॉर गिवन वैन एंड देन ओके सो द टूडे टॉपिक इज़ वेरी एक्साइटिंग सो इन टूडे टॉपिक वट आई एम कवरिंग आई एम कवरिंग हाउ वी कैन जनरेट कुकम्बर एस टी एम रिपोर्ट फॉर द साइप्रस टेस्ट केसेज सो देर आर नॉर्मली फाइव स्टेप टू जनरेट क्यूकम्बर एस टी एम एल रिपोर्ट इन द फर्स्ट टाइम इंस्टॉल द प्लग इन विच हेल्प एस टू जनरेट द जेसन फाइल राइट इन स्टेप टू आई विल जस्ट रन दिस कमांड टू रन द फीचर फाइल इन स्टेप थ्री आई विल आई विल इंस्टॉल बन अदर प्लग इन मल्टीपल क्यूकम्बर एस टी एम एल रिपोर्टर विच हेल्प एस टू जनरेट एस टी एम एल फाइल देन द फर्स्ट टाइम आई विल क्रिएट अ जी एस फाइल विच विल हेल्प एस टू रीड द जेसन फाइल दैट आई हैव क्रिएट इन द वो स्टेप देन फाइनली आई विल जनरेट अ एस टी एम एल रिपोर्ट so for all this step I have created one block here for medium medium page here so normally what I do for every video I create a blog so that it's very easy for the folks to understand in easily so in in case they are not able to understand from the video they can go through this blog and they can execute all these step okay <clears throat> so in this first step I this is already done I, in, in my last video, I already installed Cypress Cucumber preprocessor. Now I have to update this packet or JSON. So I have already done here. So if you see here, what I have done the changes here. So in the output folder, I have given the path of my JSON where I am going to generate a JSON file. Okay. Then file prefix and file suffix. In the next step, what I have to do, I have to run this command. This command will do create a JSON file. So I will just run this login dot feature file, and it will generate a JSON file under the Cypress folder. So here is the you can see here is the you can see here the path. So under this path, Cypress Cucumber JSON, there is one JSON is generated with the name login dot cucumber dot JSON. Okay, so just give me a moment to running. So it will executing all the steps here. So in the meantime, what I can do, I can install this. Okay, no, no, just just wait for to execute all the test cases. Then I will install this another plugin. So here you can see all the steps are running still second step is running and then finally one more step here yeah third step it's almost complete yeah okay so it's run and let me close this and let me see yeah here you can see login.cucumber.json is created here so if you see this file it very we can easily understand it so all the given when and then is you can see here so i navigate to the web uh, to the website status pass okay whatever i have given under given when and then i enter the valid credential it pass then similarly valid the title of the login it pass that's all okay now what the next step ne my json file is generated now i have to create the html file so before creating the HTML file, I have to install this plugin. Let me quickly install this plugin. Okay. And in the meantime, what I do, I just copy this. This is one of the JS file that we have to create. Why we create, why we need the JS file? In, in, in the JS file, we will give the path of our JSON file. Here you can see I have given the path of my JSON file and I have also given the path of my report where I want my report to be saved. So let me quickly copy this JS file. So first I have to create, let me create this JS file here. So I have to create in the root folder. So let me give, yeah, here it is. So just give me a moment yes okay sorry i think it's already i have already created here you can see 
yeah here you can see i actually i already copy here so here you can see whatever i have mentioned here it already here so here just the json directory name here right so this is the path basically cucumber json then login cucumber. so i have to give the path of my json file then i have to give the path of my report where i want to install my uh, where i want to uh, store uh, where i want to save my report so uh, under this path my report will be saved okay so this is all done let me quickly check my yeah here you can see this dev dependency multiple cucumber item also installed here now what is the next step? this step is we already done now to run the this this file basically this js file basically so how you can run this js file we can just run this js file with the help of node cucumber okay so what it will do it will what this command will do it will go it will go to the js file this is the js file yes this is it will go uh, in in the js file and it will capture this this path base of the json right and it will read this json login dot cucumber json file from here then with then it will generate a report under reports cucumber with the name cucumber html report html let me quickly run this here you can see report is generated let me quickly see let me refresh this is the report and here you can see let me open this index.html yep here you can see this is the my html report okay so here you can see all the given when and then all the scenario login with new sign up with valid data given when then everything mentioned yes second scenario with invalid data login in new sign up user with invalid data this is my third step okay so this is one of the great feature you can say we can integrate with cypress we right with the help of plugin so this is the report okay so guys this is all about this video so please like the video and subscribe the channel okay so i am coming with with some more exciting video please be stay tuned thanks